Hey guys, and welcome back to our playthrough of the forest. The latest update has come out this week. We are now on Alpha 0.15, their 15th version, 14th update. And as of this one, there's a few new things inside of us. So let's pop open here and see if we can find them. Now, I am literally just read stuff and just came in the game. I have not looked at anything yet, so I'm looking at it with you. There's some new things that's supposed to have been made. New decorations. New wood target. Now, what this is, is, as you would think, a bow and arrow target. So if you're wanting to practice your shots, for example, we'll go over to our invincible tree right here. Let's turn it around. And it's just going to do it on its own again. I hate it when it does that. Becomes really? It becomes possessed and just starts turning on its own. You know, we're just going to put it right there. So, for it, paint, really? Let's see, blue paint was two berries and tree set. Then we need four sticks and a log. Fail. See, <laughs> I don't know what's up with this guy. He can't cut crap. Like, I've seen people far away from it hit it no problem. Me? I have pretty much had to be like right on top of it. And even right on top of it, still don't hit. <laughs> Welcome to the latest episode of Swinging at the Air. <laughs> and he runs through it and hits it. Oh. This game. It's fun. It just seems like my my game in particular is just my computer's piece of crap on it. Since it's a tad bit dark, let's go ahead and sleep. And we'll grab our extra log over here. Now, there's several new things that they have added in this, one of which is the new little animal, the wild pig. Now, this is an aggressive animal. Hey, we got a target now. It is an aggressive animal, so that means I'm thinking it's going to be like the sharks in the water. So if you get near it on the land, it's going to kill you. Or at least it's going to attempt to kill you. One of the things also is like with this water pot, for example. If it is raining now, you can hold the water pot and it will actually collect the water. Wrong door. I've got too many doors around here. So you can collect it that way. And I was sitting there thinking one of the things I did not do in the last one with the last update 
more yellow piss water is I did not make the water skin so I need to actually do that which I'll do that in a moment or try to because I think it's two deer skin I only have one I think that's cooking down let's see yep I only have one looks like there's actually three things you need for water skin I have plenty of rabbit fur but I already got the berries so but I'm thinking what I'm gonna do is after we get us <coughs> sorry after we get a drink we're going to really come on it won't let me drink my water Oh, come on, this is not fair. <sighs> Damn it. Yes, I just have to do it this way. We're going to spend all the time <laughs> dinner just trying to get a freaking drink of water. Ugh. networks I still can't believe the fire won't let me drink the water <laughs> let's see well let me have it now I freaking had a drink so I really screw it we're just gonna leave it there guys Forget it. <sighs> Let's go ahead and top off our food here. Now, some of the other things that they added before we go do this. Let's see, how many teeth do we got? 23. So let's put up the axe and. Let's not let me add them on here no more. So apparently they removed the up they fixed the upgrade system they said to where you can limit it to thirty you know teeth and axes and all that and thirty upgrades altogether. So you can do like 30 teeth or 30 feathers or 10 and 20 or mix them up however you want. Besides that, but for some reason, apparently, I don't understand it. It's not allowing me to put them on there anymore. 
So it's just so screwed up, I don't understand it. Might be just a disax, you know, it's the latest update, so. I was going to go ahead and fix that, but screw it. One of the other things that they did is they added, let me look at it real quick. Bed, new furniture. So you have a bed that you put inside your home. So, for example, since we're going to head this way anyways, let's go ahead and pop into our lookout station. Because when you stop and think about it, we can make all these custom buildings, but unless we put another thing inside of it, we couldn't save inside. So, that's where this comes in. We put the bed inside of it, and it's just turned into Minecraft, and we can sleep wherever we want. Oh, that's right. We had a little lip here. Okay. Uh... You know what? Let's just put it there. So one rope and 17 sticks. So let's go ahead and do that one. And another thing is, you know, all the decorations and everything. Apparently there's new stuff inside of the caves and all that. And since we have a cave right over here, we're going to go check that cave out. Big spider. But even though we're on, you know, peaceful mode, vegan mode, we shouldn't, really. Since we're on vegan mode, we shouldn't have to worry about dying, supposedly. I mean, I have been wrong before. I am wrong a lot. A whole lot. You know this. I feel like I spent more time just swinging around randomly for nothing. I clicked water. Yeah. Oh, and you know how on the last episode. You know, we couldn't do anything with a tortoise shell. Now, they fix it to where you actually have room to put it into your... Oh, it's back here. Behind the rebreather. Back where I can't click on it because the rebreather's in the way. <laughs> so, yeah, in that, uh, there's your issue. You need to fix that. I mean, honestly, it's, it's fine, though, because I got everything that I needed anyways. And their next update is supposed to be 28 days from this update as they move up to Unity 5, which Unity is the coding system that they use, the engine, to make these games. And I've played on Unity, and it's actually really fun. And uh, there's just a lot of stuff to it. And the latest version just came out. This one was made so far with Unity 4. Next one, everything's supposed to be switched over to Unity 5, which is supposed to upgrade the game a lot. So we'll find that out next month whenever the new one comes out for that. You gotta feel sorry for the boy. He's like right against the 
freaking thing and he still can't hit it most of the time. I saw anything in an update I would like to see you know this fixed some way or another because he constantly just swings at nothing I mean dude it's got issues it's funny as crap to watch him though He tries his hardest. He swings with all of his might for no reason. Alright, now we have a bed. We finally have a bed. We can go to sleep and we can save. Right, we made a drying rack, but we didn't put nothing on it yet. I need to actually get some more food. I'll have to keep an eye out for that. But first and foremost, let's go ahead and head over here. We're going to plop down into the cave, and we're going to go exploring a little bit. We're going to check out all these changes they made. New decorations and whatnot. If I remember correctly, it's over here. Should be a big clearing. There it is. I'm stuck on a rock. <gasps> really? Really? I did not hit E. I did not let go of it. I was going down. What the heck? I don't know if it was armor or what, but how the heck I did not die from that? I do not understand. <laughs> Get her stamina back up. Thank God I had tons of meds. It's holy crap. Open it. No. So we can see where this would have all the little mutant babies in it. So this would tell me that we would probably have Spider Lady down here somewhere. Which means this would have been a whole bunch of nope. Like, nope, we're done, nope, not doing this, no. <laughs> but, let's go ahead and grab another rope. This says I can carry any more ropes, so I'll just choose one. Immortal cases, I can no longer open a suitcase down here. There he goes. 
More snack bars, good. Arms laying everywhere. Of course we'll take the booze. Booze are always necessary. Just for the sheer fact that we're going to be stuck on this island, we're going to want a drink. Oh, I apologize again. The phone's always ringing when I record. So, I'm going to hang out here until the phone's done. Give me a minute, guys. Alright, and we are back. Sorry about that. Bloody telemarketers calling all the time, harassing us for no reason whatsoever. And it's always whenever we're going to get on here and we're doing our stuff, that's when they call. Not when we're actually doing absolutely nothing, just sitting around, killing time, bored as crap. No, it's when we're actually wanting to work on something and trying to work on something. stuck on the sides of rocks and he doesn't like jump and move you gotta like start moving and jump what? that rock just looks weird let's see I'm more wondering the guys if I'm gonna even be able to get out of here cause I know I'm gonna go and try to climb out of this rock and this is gonna let go again and make me freaking fall. Need to find the other way out. They said check the back of the caves in the update. A little surprises and this and that. And you know, I've been going through and there's like nothing hardly at all in this cave. Like the only surprises I've found inside this cave is there's no getting out of it. And one of the things that they added is supposed to be in here is a rock climbing axe, which I have not seen anywhere at all. And I guess that's probably the only way I could actually get up that one spot right there. So maybe I need to look for that for a moment. Honestly, so far though, I'm not really impressed with the caves. This cave actually seems like it has less stuff in it than what it normally did. Which is very disappointing for me. Well, we have a cassette, so at the very least we can change music in the cassette player that we never use. 
Double check back through here. Maybe I missed some. Besides all the suitcases that I couldn't open. See, it's like I come all the way up here and then there's just like nothing. Now I'm gonna get cold, I'm gonna die. I don't have enough sticks to make anything. This cable is complete bust, guys, so let's see if we can even make it out. Then even if we make it out, are we going to die from freezing? <laughs> So far, so good. Let's see if we can make it the rest of the way. So yeah, that was a complete bust. Let's go check out our home. We built our lookout station. Use it. A door with a stump on it we can't even use. Our fire killed a bird. <laughs> That's coming. Okay. So, at the very least... That's just funny. I need a drink. The 
turtle. The turtle! Okay, let's pull the book back up. Let's take a look at the other stuff at the very least again. Skull lamp. Let's see. Hey, three sticks. Let's go ahead and grab these three sticks. Okay. Let's attempt to grab these three sticks. I've already showed you that that doesn't work for me that well. Finding that medium place, that sweet spot, each time, each tree is like different. See? And now he's exhausted. <laughs> Poor boy is sitting there swinging his little heart out, trying to sit there and just cut down a tree, and he's got no energy to do it. You gotta feel sorry for the lad. Come on. Okay, I really don't feel sad for him either, but. Poor guy, he's gonna have to toughen up. He's gonna have to learn to get some better stamina. He's stuck out here all alone. I'm just gonna put the light out. I'm sure we can see. It's so funny just how that this roof has come along. And this roof actually took less logs than what you would think looking at it. Okay, and it just lit up on its own. I didn't even have to light it. Okay. So this makes me wonder, is it going to be like it's all the time? Does it stay lit all the time? Hmm. Puts out a good bit of light though, doesn't it? That's actually a good one. Let's see. Let's look through the book real quick. Decorations. Deer skin. <laughs> of course, I just used that. Decorative skull. I think this is supposed to be mounted to the wall. Yep. Yeah. Put it right there. <laughs> Alrighty. And deer skin. We could put it on the wall. Or we could put it on the floor as a rug. So you know what? Let's see. Well, I thought we could. Let's put it on the wall. Let's put it right here. The next episode, we'll go try to find us another deer, and we'll check out the for the wild pig and see what we can find with it. Animal traps. Traps. Yeah, I think it's all the new basic stuff, though. So two more skulls. All right, but we have had a chance to test out a couple of things with this. At the very least, we have built the target for our arrows over at the main fort. We have made a brand new bed so we can actually sleep everywhere now. We have a very bright light. Bright light. I remember that game. I used to play with those things all the time. Love 
Well, it's a lot broader, but lot. It looks like it's a lot broader. Anyway, we have our skull lamp, and we can put our skulls on the wall. We can put deer skins on the wall, or supposedly on the floor, but it's not letting us. Maybe it's got to meet certain conditions. And just like that, another bird dies. And we can light a fire, and our birds will just keep flying to their death. <laughs> we went and checked out the cave, which unfortunately was crap. There wasn't anything in it. So, next episode, we're going to come back, and we're going to go out, try to find a deer so we can finish up the skin and then we're gonna go and try to find that wild pig and see if we can do anything with it the upgrade system unfortunately as you saw was just a complete fail also as it just would not take it whatsoever I think one of the things that they should do is like with this roof how it just comes through the roof doesn't really serve much purpose it really doesn't I think what they should do is go back and look at like maybe adding sticks and leaves and mud or whatever to it to kind of help seal it up and I think that would be a good one to do it's not just collecting this or collecting that well it actually it is I mean Because even our fire that's inside is being put out by the rain. So that's a bit of an issue. I mean, the game is coming along really well. They're going to keep adding. They're going to keep updating. I mean, we definitely found a few bugs today. With the upgrade system now, it's not letting me upgrade my axe at all. Which would probably only put it on the plain axe for right now. Which is really disappointing for me. And <laughs> that fall. Oh my god. I did not hit the button to let go. It just. Uh, I was holding down S. It was going down and he just let go. So. It's either a bug in the system or my guy is just freaking weak. Which. Crap. He can't even cut down a bush half the time. But yeah. So, next episode, we're going to work on that, and the fire's out again. <laughs> next episode, we'll work on that. It actually looks like it does stay lit all the time. Water didn't put it out, so... I'll probably end up putting these all over the place in. Just for the sure fact that they stay lit. I like that. We're going to work on that. But, that's it for today's episode, guys. Until next time, this is TK, Lost in the Forest. Hey guys, if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you go and click the like button. Let us know you actually did enjoy it. If you haven't already, make sure to click that subscribe button because we are doing episodes every week. We have live stuff on Mondays, we have Space Engineers on Wednesdays, and we have The Forest on Fridays like you see. So we're trying to do stuff three times a week at least. We might have random stuff put up now and then, but for the most part, that's what we do. And then, also take a look down below. You have two images. You have the left one, which is our featured channel for the week. If you want to be featured, just drop a comment down below saying it, and we'll check out your channel. We like you. We're going to feature you for a week on all three episodes on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at the end of every episode. And also, make sure to check out the thumbnail on the bottom right and that is our one of the other videos that we have been working on so make sure to check those out also 